Hi all, welcome back to Order 16 development tutorial videos. In this video, we are going to discuss about wizards in Order 16. A wizard is simply a model that extends the class transient model instead of model. Wizard records are not database persistent, that is, they are automatically deleted from the database after a certain time. So by the end of this video, we will learn about wizard how to define wizard and how we can launch them. For that, we can go to our custom module tips and tricks and inside the form view, let's add a new button at the top and let's see how we can launch a wizard on that button click. For that, open PyCharm and this is our custom model tips and tricks. First of all, we have to create a new directory called wizard for creating the wizard model. So I'm creating a new Python package called wizard. Inside this wizard directory, I'm creating a new Python file. Inside this python file, I am creating model for the transient model. First of all, from order, we have to import models and fields. We know transient models are used for creating the wizard model. So I am searching for the transient model inside the python and here I am just copying this and I am pasting it inside my custom python file. I am changing the class name to tips info wizard and I am changing the name of class to tips.info and the description to tips info wizard after this i am creating new custom field for the wizard model that is partner id and node a partner id is a mini to one field which relates the model restored partner and the node is a field of type text so first, I am creating the field partner id and the core model is given as rest.partner. The next field is node. So I am creating the node field. So type text and the string is added as node. After this, we have to create a simple form view for this particular model. So for that, inside the wizard, create a new file called tips info view .xml and add the order tag. Inside it, add data tag. And just search for the tag form inside the XML file. So I am just searching for a simple form view. I am copying this record and I am pasting it here. And we have to change the right ID of the record. And uh, the name and we have to change the model name so I'm just copying my no model name from my Python file and I'm pasting it here then the form string I'm changing it to tips 
info and inside the group tag I'm adding my new custom fields that is partner ID I'm adding the string as partner and the next field is not after creating the form view and the model we have to import the python file inside the init file next inside the main init we have to import the wizard next thing is to add this xml file inside the manifest so i'm just adding the xml file so i'm just copying the path and i'm pasting it here one thing to make sure is that you have added the model access rights inside the csv file so i am just copying this one and pasting it here and i'm just renaming the ids this is the model name so we have to specify the model name for a wizard model and i'm just removing the group info from here next thing is to add a button inside the tip centrics form view for that in the forms inside the views open the form view for the tip centrics model we have already added the button here the button string is added as add info the type is object so we have to specify a method inside the model tip centrics called button add info for that inside the models open the tip centrics model and define a new method for that i am just copying the same name and i am pasting it here now in this button method we have to return an action to open the form view of the wizard model for that we can just search for ir actions active window inside the python files so i am just searching for a return action sorry so we can copy this particular action and we can paste it here so the return action is of type ir.actions.activeWindow we don't want to use the res id so we can just remove that the res model is the model of wizard so we can just go to our wizard model and copy the model name and we can paste it here for name i am just adding a 
string called info tag and the view mod is form I am specifying the target as new and also removing the views so by specifying the target as new the wizard will be opened in a new window so we can just restart the service and see how the wizard will be launched we can go to our apps and search for our custom app upgrade it from here now go to our custom module and open the form view so that here we can add sorry we can see the button so let's see if the wizard is launched on this button click here we can see that the wizard is launched with our custom field partner id and not and the info tab is added here which is specified in the name so this is how we can launch wizard in order 60 hope you understood thanks for watching Thank you.